Hey there again, guys. This is Thumper with Blue Collar Builders. You are at the Inner Solar Conference for North America here in San Francisco at the Moscone Center. I'm going to take you into the Easy Roof Evolution. You're seeing tomorrow today. I'm here with uh, Mateo, and he's going to instruct us on what the features are of this product. Great. Thanks, Thumper. Um, we've got a building integrated mounting solution for standard solar modules. I'm looking at this, and it looks like you're mounting it directly over the tar paper before you put the roofing material on. Is that correct? Exactly. The roofing material works around our flashings. We're mounting these frames directly into either the decking, the battens, and then, of course, uh, the underlayment as well. Extremely lightweight, um, easy to carry around, and it's got a top flashing, and then we have side flashings that we add where needed at the end of the rows but full water movement into the gutters keeps the roof dry. It's a very clever solution. The water that comes off the modules then comes down and gets moved into the gutters and down. And this is a completely dry space in here. These are our uh, brackets, right? So we attach the brackets directly into the battens or into the decking. These do not need to be flashed because it's in a dry space. And then the modules, the wiring comes through and into the next one. And it's a standard size module? Yeah, so any 60 cell, 6 inch module we can use and that's the standard right now in the US. Awesome, so let's talk about the features that people, what's the benefit, one, to the installer and two, for the homeowner? Well, for the installer, um, they're going to save money. Uh, when you are doing a re-roof or a new home, the cost of the roofing material is quite high. By having the solar module become your roof, you've saved that money for that. And this is a little bit like replacing polymorphic uh, tile roofing. Yes. So you're talking the, the, the solar shingles? Right. Yes. So this is a, definitely a very good solution to the solar shingles, which are uh, much more costly and expensive and a lower performance generally as well. Uh, we're using silicon modules uh, with whatever efficiency you buy, you know, 270 watt, 245, whatever ones you're purchasing. Okay, to be uh, fair though, uh, polymorphic uh, solar has a bigger spectrum, right, uh, and can handle more heat. Is this going to be an issue with you guys mounted this close? Um, we actually do have airflow, so there's channels here that allow for air movement out on the top and also here at the bottom. Um, it's less airflow than your standard uh, racking, so we do see higher temperatures and we do see a little bit of duration. So on a square footage area, it's really about a 4% derate where you can see, you know, 10, 15% or more on your shingles, your solar shingles. Yeah, and it's good. These cells have higher efficiency than polymorphic. Exactly. Okay, so the, probably an offset there then? Yeah quite a bit. We actually end up being quite a bit more because of the higher efficiency of the initial product. What about someone who has a standing seam roof? Do you have anything that integrates to metal? Absolutely. You just would bring up the standing seam over our flashings. Um, on this side of the roof, our demonstration roof, we're using the tile. We have asphalt shingle on the other. But any roof type that you can bring up to our flashings and attach, it will work. Okay. One of the things that's going to be super important for homeowners is it has to be watertight. They don't want to go in get into tr trouble with them. Uh, Absolutely. Absolutely. It's watertight. The roofers uh, that we've shown this to love it. We have 30,000 installations in Europe. We've passed the water, rain, uh, wind tests that you have to. Uh, this is a dry area and it's great. So no leaks. What do they test it up to? Um, as far as uh, wind versus uh, the, the rain coming down at the same time? Uh, like a hurricane? Yes. Um, I. Not sure of the exact numbers, I have to pull it up, but we've got the great videos to show in a wind tunnel and the rain being sprayed down and the different tests that had to be done in Europe to pass uh, certification there. Okay, why don't you tell people what that website is? Uh, it is IRFTS.com. And explain what that acronym means. A French company, uh, it's the Fundamental Research Institute of Solar Technology. And just to be clear, this whole area here is water tight. It's watertight. These flashings help with that and this movement of water helps with that. It works great and you end up with a very beautiful product too. That's the other thing we didn't speak about. It saves you money, it keeps the roof dry, but really in the end the customer is going to look at this and have a much better looking roof than your standard racking. 
better aesthetic integration. Absolutely. Awesome. Thank you, Mateo. Well, you saw it here at Easy at the uh, Easy Roof booth here at the uh, convention here and the Intersolar Conference. You saw tomorrow here today. Thank you for joining us. My name is Thumper with Blue Collar Builders. Thanks again, Mateo. Right, Appreciate you. it, buddy. Yeah, yeah. All right.